Hi folks, my name is Paul Carlson and I'm the owner of Safety Solutions Academy and I'm here with you today for gun safety tip number five, the big picture rule. This is the fifth video in our series of 30 videos that deal with gun safety and we're putting these out for National Safety Month here in June of 2015. If you haven't caught the first four videos, make sure you head to www.ssa.training slash gun safety. And that's where you can find all the videos we've released so far. The big picture rule. Credit to this rule really goes to Rob Pincus of ICE Training. He's one of the founders of the Combat Focus Shooting Program. And in that program, he teaches his instructors to share with their students this big picture rule. It goes something like this. Keep in mind that you are in charge of a deadly weapon. If you use that deadly weapon with malice or with negligence, you could hurt or kill yourself or somebody else. Yeah, that's right, folks. When you handle firearms, you are in charge of a deadly weapon. And that's really what it comes down to. The big picture rule, the fact that firearms have serious consequences if misused, is the reason why gun safety is so important. And it's something we need to keep in mind whenever we interact with firearms. So folks, think about that big picture rule. The fact that you are the one that's in control. When you're in control of a firearm, you need to first of all, think. You need to use your brain. You need to think about what actions you're going to take and what consequences those actions can have. That's important because again, you are in control. The second thing you need to, do, need to do, excuse me, is to mitigate risk. That's what firearm safety rules are about. That's what making good decisions about is finding that balance. And we talked about that. And we talked about safety as a big concept. Find that balance where the benefits of your actions significantly outweigh the risks. Third thing you need to do is when you realize you're in over your head, when things seem like they're going wrong, stop. If something bad hasn't happened yet and you simply stop and don't do anything, then nothing bad is going to happen. You need to make sure when you're thinking about gun safety, when you're thinking about safety in general, that when things start to head in a negative direction, that you stop and sort it out before you act. Taking the wrong action can have more consequences, in fact, much more consequence than doing nothing at all. So when you're out on the range, when you're in the basement cleaning your guns, when you're simply getting ready to put that gun on to head out for the day, remember that if you're not sure what it is that's going on, stop. Don't do anything else until you figure it out and that is gonna to help to keep you safer. Folks, you need to understand the big picture. Again, that's why I'm putting together these 30 videos of gun safety for the month of June. Show that you understand the big picture and make sure you watch every single one and share these videos with other folks that have firearms in their lives. Folks, June is National Safety Month, but every day is Gun Safety Day.